I, I hope we have some way of um, finding tomes or something to recover all these ability points we've been losing. So uh, Jim was never a power power gaming character, so he, he's always had weaknesses. <laughs> and uh, throughout the game, he's been losing the most important stats. When I say throughout the game, I mean obviously uh, Baldur's Gate 2. So the very beginning, because I felt he had too many hit points, I reduced his constitution by one. And then um, when he went to spell hold, he lost another one. Um, and that was by choice. Probably should have chosen intelligence or something less important. Um, and then, obviously, just now we've lost dexterity. So it's, I think he's weaker than he was in. Uh, the of Ball lies very close to here, child of Ball. Just beyond either of these two rooms before you. Okay, uh, I was just saying, um, yeah, I think his uh, core ability stats are now weaker than they were in Baldur's Gate 1. Um, or at least he's lost all the benefits of the tomes that uh, he gained. Um, here, Val lies very close to you. You must choose. It's beyond either of these two rooms before you. This demon is called Fear. Which makes me worry that we don't have any um, <laughs> resist fear on, on the party at the moment. You have encountered many times in your existence where you have been forced to swallow your fear, no? You have fought off terror that would overwhelm a lesser being and shown courage instead. Pass through either of these rooms and your vaunted courage shall be challenged, child of Baal. I have something I will offer, however. Which will make it so much easier for you, child. You know, like so many with power, that items of magic can do much that the ordinary man cannot. Such as this cloak, for instance. Stitched together from the flayed skins of lovely nymphs. Wear it and be soothed by its powerful magic. Panic will never overcome you again. With this cloak, you could easily gather the tear of Baal and worry not of your courage. I bow to the power of your divine soul, child, and offer this cloak up to you, if you wish it. Alright, I think, um, to be honest, Jin is, uh, <laughs> quite tempted, but with, uh, uh, Ares' assertive stare, I think he will do the right thing. Um, I do not need a cloak to give me courage, fiend. Take it and be gone. Then you choose to rely on your own power and bravery. It shall be as you wish, child of Baal. I think the key thing is, um, Odia. <laughs> Elder Orb. Yeah, that's something that actually strikes fear into me as well as Jin. Yes? <laughs> um, okay, let's prepare for battle. Um, okay, uh, everyone has chaotic commands except your hero. Chaotic commands. What can I do? Is this here? Okay, so one of them definitely includes Beholders, or at least an Elder Orb. Um, hmm, Elder Orb also have True Sight. We do have plenty of Reach, so I think we can take down an Elder Orb's defenses. Jim with a Cloak should be okay. Um, I guess we're gonna probably rest before confronting our Anarchus, so... Spell trap. Now you don't. Um. Mm -hmm. Alright, Airy. Uh, I don't think we need that. Okay. We all have resist fear. Yeah, I, I don't know what the uh, different cards offer, so we'll just pick one at random. Yeah, there's a chest in that one. Good to go. Demon, I think he's invisible. Check the traps. Trap found. 
Okay. Open it. Ah, oh, potions. Okay, that's good. It's not bad at all. Uh, what are they? Potion of invulnerability. Fire giant strength. It's going to be useful. Primarily for chain, actually. Now I'm going to pop down the um, other wood cooker. I think that's where the um, tier of bow is, but concerned about anyone getting ambushed, so. So we'll just head in there so that she's not alone. Um, the hewer. I don't just summon a fire elemental. Okay. Ow. Alright. I want to all protect by spell trap. So obviously there's uh, beholders on the other side. Um, Jane's gonna make a run for it and see if we can grab the spear of ball without fighting. You face fear without resorting to the protection of the pa and patch power of evil. The tear of ball is yours. Okay. But there's no need to what fight the group of beholders without um, reason if we got what we came for. The party will make their escape. Hopefully we didn't miss out on any treasure, but um, this is hell, so... Jin isn't really expecting to find treasure in hell. Um, right, final room. Let's say... I don't know if I was just lucky in picking which uh, side to choose, or if somehow the game recognizes he chose not to take the cloak. I also wonder what the consequences of taking the cloak would have been. Ah, so the child Pride. of Bull comes to me finally for the last of the tears of Bull. You have come very near to locating your quarry. Yes, indeed you have. Oh, young Lord of Murder. Oh, wait. I think I just repeated what he said. Uh, what are you talking about? All I've done is been subjected to a series of strange tests. Uh, I suppose you're going to tell me Aranicus has been waiting behind that strange door this entire time. Of course not. He moves fast. If you, you close on him quickly, the tests you make are clever. Oh, young lord of murder, your power here is strong. What do you mean? How do you find your soul, child of Val? Do you find it on a stroll? No, you must know yourself. The depth of your passion and the height of your depravity. <clears throat> you come to know what you are capable of, and, that's you, and that shall open the way to your soul. It is yourself, your essence, that you seek, whether you know it or not. And because this is what you seek, your power fights against the mage and brings you closer to your goal. Soon you shall open the eyes with the tear of Baal. And what then? The door will open and Irenicus will be there? The way to your soul shall be revealed, but only but you only perceive it as a door. A pity that mortal minds cannot encompass more power than their faculties can comprehend. I hope you have been careful, child of Baal. The nine hells are a place of retribution. The tears sting as easily as they soothe. Why are you speaking so cryptically? What does that mean? I obscure the truth because it is because it is my nature to do so, Lord of Murder. But I bow to your mastery here and answer your questions nonetheless. It is a good thing you've come to me, child of Bull. Only you hold the power to vanquish the terrible creature that holds one of your dead father's tears here. I have heard of your prowess, child. Most impressive for a mortal life. Creatures of great power thrown aside as if they were nothing. Beings any other mortal would quake before, you have fought against valiantly. You are a wonder of destruction, child of all. Go then and defeat the creature that lies in the cavern. Cross it beneath your heel and claim another victory!
What manner of creature do you speak of? It is a powerful creature, child of war. One that only you can destroy. I am confident in your ability to deal death to such a creature as this and take the tear that is yours. It is powerful, but what manner of creature is it? Obviously, given he's called Pride, <laughs> I think he's trying to, um, yeah, essentially stoke Jin's ego. It is a creature that deserves death, child of war. You are such a wondrous fighter. I simply thought that you could defeat it where others failed. Why does it deserve death? Because, because it exists. It stands in your way. Are you saying that it will not give me the tear? Well, no. It might give it to you if you ask it nicely <laughs> enough, I suppose. I see that despite your great deeds, you have no pride in your child of all. So be it. Humility serves well those who wield it well. Okay. Now you don't. On my honor, it shall be. So it looks like we've been able to avoid a battle. Okay. Avoid a battle. It's a dragon. Hello, dragon. Hopefully, we don't have to fight you. What do you I wonder if uh, I think we could have probably Consider taken him on. You have mastered your pride, Jin. The tier of ball is yours. Go well. Okay. Okay, the dragon went. Um, check around, see if there's nothing here. Okay, there is something here. Healing potion and... Potion of vulnerability. Um, yes, that's useful. I'm kind of wondering if we might have missed yes. something with beholders. I will do my best. I really am not a you fan of beholders. <laughs> it's, a, it's kind of fitting that the beholders were in the uh, cavern associated with fear. I genuinely fear beholders more than I do a dragon. <laughs> um, I think Jim would agree yes. with me. All right, and I think. This will then be the final confrontation against Tyrannicus. Now that we have all five tiers of ball, um, right? Okay. Um, I think it's a good time to uh, end the video, and next time we will again, probably, hopefully, be fighting the final battle against Tyrannicus. Uh, I'll see you then.